Hi, welcome to Sunil Maths Tutorial Online Classes. Again, previous year question, June 2013, Part C, which carries 4.75 marks, no negative marking. There may be more than one correct answer. The problem is, F max capital R into R be a continuous function with period P greater than 0. F max capital R into R is continuous and also it has period P. It has period P. What it means? F of X plus P is equals to F of X. And G of X is equals to integral X to X plus P. G of X is equals to integral X to X plus P. F of T dt. F of T dt. Is options are constant function, continuous function, continuous but not differentiable. Neither continuous nor differentiable. By using Leibniz rule, by using Leibniz rule of differentiation under integral sign, g dash of x is equals to integral x2 x plus p dou by dou x of f of t dt plus f of x plus p into d by dx of upper limit x plus p minus f of x into d by dx of lower limit x. Observe that by applying the Leibniz rule for differentiation under integral sign g dash of x is equals to integral x to x plus p dou by dou x of f of t dt f of x plus p d by dx of upper limit x plus p minus f of x into d by dx of lower limit x. Here f of t, it is in the variable t, we differentiate it with respect to x, so it becomes 0 plus 0 plus f of x plus p d by dx of x plus p is nothing but 1 minus f of x. This is nothing but f of x plus p minus f of x. Now use the period condition. The function is periodic with respect to the period p. So f of x plus p is equals to f of x. You get f of x minus f of x which is equals to 0. Therefore we prove that g dash of x is equals to 0. Derivative of g is 0. Derivative of g is 0 means g of x is constant. g of x is constant. Observe that g dash of x is equals to 0 means derivative of g is 0. It means g is a constant function. g is a constant function. Option 1 is correct. We know that every constant function is continuous. Option 2 also correct. So every constant function is continuous. Continuous but not differentiable. Every constant function is differentiable. Option 3 is wrong. Neither continuous nor differentiable is also wrong. Observe that. You remember the rule, Leibniz rule for differentiation under integral sign and periodic definition, periodic function definition, then it is very easy to solve. 